If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. When you create a new sales tax in Sage 50 Accounting, you use a step-by-step -step setup sales taxes wizard to help you create the two parts of the sales tax. First, you either select or create the sales tax agencies for whom you collect sales tax within a single sales transaction. Second, you then create the sales tax code you use in sales transactions to collect sales tax for those sales tax agencies. Sales tax agencies are the individual governmental authorities for whom you collect a single sales tax. A sales tax code is a group of one or more sales tax agencies you create and assign within sales transactions to calculate and collect the sales tax for the sales tax code's associated sales tax agencies. Later, to see how much sales tax has been collected per sales tax agency, you run the taxable slash exempt sales report. To set up sales tax agencies and sales tax codes in Sage 50 Accounting, select Maintain Sales Taxes from the menu bar to open the Set Up Sales Taxes window. This window contains the options for creating, editing, deleting, and maintaining sales tax codes and sales tax agencies. To set up a new sales tax in this window, select the Set Up a New Sales Tax option. Then click the Next button at the bottom of the window to continue. In the next screen, enter the total rate to charge for the sales tax into the first available field. If the sales tax is based on a formula, then leave the percentage field blank. Next, use the drop-down to select the number of individual agencies that make up the total sales tax rate to collect. After making your choices, Click the Next button to continue. In the next screen, set up the taxing agencies for the sales tax by entering the information for each taxing agency selected on the previous screen. Be sure to indicate how much of the total tax rate each sales tax agency vendor is collecting and which account you use to track the sales tax you collect. If you need to enter a sales tax rate based on a formula versus a flat percentage, use the drop down in the middle of the screen to select the Buy Formula option. When finished, click the Next button to continue setting up your tax agencies. If you have only one agency collecting a single tax or after entering all the taxing agencies, the last screen lets you name the sales tax code. You can also select if you need to charge tax on shipping for your state. Once that information is entered, then click the Finish button to finish creating the sales tax. In the future, to edit, delete, or review the sales tax codes and sales tax agencies, open the Set Up Sales Taxes screen again. To edit either the tax agency information or the associated code, select the Edit an Existing Sales Tax or Sales Tax Agency option and then click the Next button. Then, in the following screens, edit either the code or the agencies as desired. As when creating the sales tax, you simply change whatever information is needed in each screen while clicking the Next button to continue. Then click the Finish button after making your changes. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.